Do you have a marketing plan? Seriously, we're almost halfway through the third quarter. What does your marketing plan look like to finish 2020? Have you increased or decreased the number of contacts that you've made in 2020 compared to last year? That would be very interesting. Have you sat down to even check on that, by the way? You see, some agents are confused because they just did a lot of business in a quick period of time the last few months, and they really just compressed about five months worth of business into two or three months. But what is your plan for the rest of the year? Now, assuming that there is not another lockdown and the interest rates and listing inventory stay low, what is your plan to get more listings, for instance? Do you even know who in your database is considering moving in the late summer or early fall? Or are you just happy that you did a lot of business the last 60 days and are content to ride out this summer and hope that things pick up again in the fall? And I'm sure a lot of agents are going to do this and it's not to knock that, but it's not a business strategy. You see at Remax Aspire, we've created a complete marketing system that you as an agent can just simply plug yourself into. We already have an app that tells you who in your database is most likely to move in the next three months. That makes it very easy for you to know who you should be reaching out to. We already have a listing coordinator who handles all of the details to get our properties on the market and you can come right in and use that. We have a system that sends newsletters and social graphics that are already created, saving you lots of time, lots of energy, and lots of money. We have content that we provide each month so that you can go out and do Popeyes. And Popeyes really leave a more lasting impression on our clients, I think, than Facebook posts or postcards. Now, I myself have recorded hundreds of these videos over the years, and I'm not sitting around saying to myself, well, gee, maybe I'll finally do videos this year. How many of you still are not doing videos because you're worried about how you look on camera? Even worse than that thought, how many agents don't have somebody that's encouraging them to do video? Because let's face it, video is a necessary part of your marketing plan. You should be doing videos like this and speaking to your audience, your customers. So if you're not getting that encouragement on video, what, how are you going to do it, right? The other thing is, are you hosting webinars on Zoom for past and potential clients? That's a great way to pick up new clients. Do your seminars on Zoom. You know, there's a lot of marketing that you could be doing. The list goes on and on and on, but you probably aren't doing as much as you should be. Let's face it, none of us are. If you would like help setting up a marketing plan for the rest of the year, go ahead and send me a message. I'd be happy to take a look at what you have and consult with you. Thanks for watching.